Walter Hamill, it's so good to have you back in the studio. Lovely to be here again. Um, I think last time was not last November, but the November before. I think so. It's been a long time. <laughs> it's been a long time, but you're looking well, I tell you. <laughs> well, thank you. You too. You change your hairstyle, mate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's true, yeah. It's this perm. Now, the last time we met, you just released your debut album, mm -hmm. Hamill, which we loved in Japan. However, back in your home country, Holland, it actually went platinum. Yeah, just a couple of weeks ago. That's right, yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. We were on a, well, quite a soppy, <laughs> all you need is love, like a show on TV, Christmas uh, edition, extra, extra cheesy and nice. I love it, but it was very uh, strange. And we sang a song, God Only Knows, by uh, the Beach Boys. Oh, wonderful. And at the end of the show, the, the, the host came up to me with his platinum award. I was totally surprised. So oh, wow. it wasn't fake surprise. I was really surprised. Oh, yeah. you didn't know it? It was I really surprise. didn't know, yeah, so the management had kept, kept it silent for me all day, yeah. <laughs> Is the Platinum Award a Platinum Disc still? Yeah, it's a, it's a small platinum disc in a nice arty display, so that was really nice. To, to so where is it, Walter? Over your fireplace? Yeah, at home. That's right, in Amsterdam. <laughs> <laughs> I know that you're a very hard-working musician. You're all over the place performing. You're even back at the Billboard Live or Saka in May. That's right, isn't yes, it? Yes, we're coming back. We're uh, looking forward to that very much, yeah. Two nights? Two nights. I think, by heart, 22nd and 23rd of May, yeah. Right. Yeah. A bit later on, you're going to do a live studio session for us. Lots of musicians in the studio. Would it be the same lineup that you bring to Osaka next no, time? No, no. In Osaka, uh, there'll be place for lots of more musicians. So, right now, I only brought my bassist, and he will be clapping and drumming a little bit, and my pianist, and he will play the melodica. Right. which is a tiny instrument and of course normally it plays a grand piano but normally I also, also have a drummer and a percussionist and a guitarist so it's wow. a big band yeah is it the same band that we saw last time because that was rocking yeah it was the same band yeah yeah that, sure. was, that was very, very nice. We're all looking forward to that, Walter. Me very, too. Very much. <laughs> After the success of the first album, what kind of venues will you be playing in 2009? Um, well, it's a very big change for us this year. Like, last year was our, our debut year, so we just did everything we could, you know. Every show or gig we could get, we did it because it's your debut and people don't know you. Right. They have to get to know you. So that's what we did until now. But now, now with that, that we've made a little name for ourselves, uh, they've booked a theatre show for a theatre tour for us in Holland. So we'll be playing 40 theatres in two months, I think. We'll wow. just be touring, touring, touring. So that's a big change because the people will be sitting and actually listening because, <laughs> as you might know, European crowds <laughs> or, or non-Asian crowds are not as attentive <laughs> or focused as Asian crowds. So uh, when we played last year, I decided to omit all the ballads we had because people start talking, getting beers in the back. But now in the theatre tour in Holland, we'll finally do all the nice slow ballads because people have all the attention. I've got a copy of the new album, which is also produced by the great Benny Sings. It's titled Nobody's Tune, and I understand it's already out in Holland. Yeah, it were, was released in um, uh, at the end of January, actually. Right. So a little bit before Japan, but the very big difference for Japan. For Japan, we decided to add three bonus tracks, which will not be released in Holland, only for digital download, but two tracks of them, those are really exclusive for Japan. So that's quite special. <laughs> we like that. Thank you. <laughs> what numbers from the album are getting played on the radio back home, Walter? Um, uh, the first Dutch single uh, is In Between. Right. And the first uh, Japanese single is One More Time in the Merry-Go-Round because both the management had a little disagreement about what, what, what would work the best for which audience. So uh, In Between is kind of a vaudeville burlesque kind of uh, nightclub trashy track and one more time the merry is a little bit more melancholic I think. If you could have had your own way Walter and released any number on the album as okay. the first single in Japan what would you have gone for? Uh, I would have gone for Nobody's Tune because it's the, the album title and maybe the, the tune itself is not as catchy as, as all the rest of the tunes it's a little bit more deep and, 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 and dark but the meaning of the song is really important to me. It's really, uh, well, it's the most heavy meaning because I'm singing that tune, Nobody's Business, I'll sing Nobody's Tune. Right. Like, offer me raindrops or drops of moon. Um, and the first lines go like this. They're not to know, they just won't care. I won't trade my secrets with a millionaire. Wow. And that's because I've got offered lots of things since my album became a little bit successful by major labels and all kinds of people who want stuff from you and I decided right. to keep on my own path 
and just stick to my own thing and, well, sing my own song. Great to so, see yeah. you again. <laughs> Before we wrap things up today, do you have a message for my listeners on Afterglow? Of course. Well, to all the listeners of Afterglow on FM Kokoro, thank you for listening. I hope you enjoyed our performance. And, of course, most importantly, I hope to see you live in Billboard in the end of May in Osaka. So I hope to see you there. Thanks for listening. Good luck with the new CD, Nobody's Tune. See you soon at the Billboard. Walter Hamill, bye-bye. Arigatou gozaimashita.